Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a little bit different and I'm very excited about it. It's my first time doing this video on my channel. So today we are doing a Zaffle bikini haul review. So I honestly used these videos so much because Zaffle is one of those websites that's very hit or miss. So you have to be completely reliant on reviews. So not only do I always read the reviews on Zaffle, but before I make an order, I usually go on YouTube and I will binge watch at least five or six of these videos to try to figure out which bikinis are worth it and which ones maybe are a little bit on the sketchy side. So today I have a couple of bathing suits that I wanna share with you guys. I think I got pretty lucky with this batch. I mean, lucky, I, I did my work, I did my research, but these are all fantastic bathing suits. I'm honestly impressed. It's been, I wanna say two, two or three years since I'd ordered from Zaffel and I would say that their quality has still slowly be going up since the first time that I ordered from them many, many, many years ago. So this is a little haul because I'm putting it out in the universe. Fingers crossed, if all goes well, in a week, I should be in Jamaica with my feet in the sand, a drink in my hand, tanning, living my best bikini life. So I'm hoping that I will get to wear all of these a very, very shortly because right now we are in the middle of winter in Quebec and it is cold. There is like feet of snow outside right now. There's a snowstorm as I'm filming this. So I'm very excited to not only put these on and start getting excited, but even more so to actually be somewhere warm and tropical. So anyways, we're gonna get into this video very shortly, but if you like this video, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up. It really is just half a second for you, but for me and all of the other creators here on YouTube or on any other platform, it really, really does mean the world to us. And if you wanna see more videos, subscribe and follow along. I would love to have you stick around. So anyways, without further ado, Let's get into the video. Okay, so number one is just a simple black bikini that I got. I got this one in a medium, so to preface, normally I would be a small in tops and a small to medium on bottoms, depending. So for most of these, I went with the medium to be safe because Zaffle is known to be a little bit on the small side, but there are, I think, a few that are small, so I will make sure that I put it all on the screen. And they're also all going to be linked down below in case you guys are interested in getting them for yourselves. So this is the top of the black one. So pretty simple, has this little V. It's like a ribbed material. I don't know if you guys can see well, but it's a nice ribbed material, very stretchy. The back of this one is a little hard to figure out. I'm still working on it, but it's got a nice crisscross design. So like I said, this is probably not put on perfectly, but you get an idea of how it should look. And the bottom is a simple, uh, like I said, also ribbed, stretchy, and it's a little bit thick up here. Goes pretty high up, which is really, really nice. Also the reason why I tend to size up, just so I have a little bit more space to be able to pull them up a little bit. I like to wear them pretty high up on my hips. It is pretty cheeky, but not too, too bad. It's not like full thong, but it does show a good amount of cheek. So here we have it for the first one. I'm a big fan, honestly, a simple black bikini like this is so useful. So that's why it was something that I wanted to make sure that I got in this haul. Because if you followed my channel, I've lost quite a little bit of weight in the last years. My body has changed quite a little bit. So most of my bathing suits didn't fit anymore. So getting a black staple was very important to me. And I think this one is a win. So there we have the first one. All right, up next, we have this really, really cute, like teal and white bathing suit. So this one is one of the ones that I got in the small, and I wish I'd gotten the size up. I wish I went with the medium. It fits really well, it looks nice, but this is so tiny, and like, I'm very small chested, and this still barely covers anything. The bottom is actually surprisingly fine. I mean, anytime you have ties like this, it's really easy to adjust but it is super super nice it has like padding and some wire here that makes it feel really supportive it i just wish it was a little bit bigger like this if i were to go in the ocean i would be worried that you know everything would be spilling out uh bottoms very cheeky i will not be showing you the entire thing but you you have the visual it's pretty much as cheeky as it gets it goes right up in there not much coverage at all 
but I think this is so nice. And it, cut, it came with a third little piece that's a little skirt, so I'm gonna put that on and show you guys. So here it is with the little skirt. It is super cute, has this little tie and it goes around and it covers almost everything, but I mean, you're at the beach. It's either this or, or a bathing suit, so it's fine. So I think this all together is really, really cute. Like I would put this on to go for a walk, to like sunbathe, all of that, obviously not sunbathe with this, but it's unfortunately not a bathing suit I think I'll be like full blown swimming with, maybe at the pool, but overall really nice. The back is very simple, just straps like this with a clasp in the back. Okay, up next we have this lilac purple one, which is also really nice. This I got in a small, so this one actually is a very true to size small. The bottom is very, very similar to the black one. Same thing, comes up a little bit higher, pretty thick here, and has like not a lot of coverage, but not full thong in the back. And then the top has this little cross here that you can actually uncross and have it be just a straight through. But I like the cross look, pretty thick straps, good amount of coverage, good amount of support. And then in the back, it's another one of those like strappy, crisscrossy details that's pretty hard to figure out. Honestly, I just took a good four or five minutes trying to figure out exactly how to put this on. But once it's on, I think it's really nice. This color is really pretty. It's gonna look really good with a little bit of a tan. And this one is a pretty good, supportive, I feel really confident that nothing's going to go anywhere. The fact also that these tie up like all together there's no straps that could be coming off anywhere so this is one of those bathing suits that i have full confidence in for going into the ocean swimming around in the waves doing anything that i feel like doing okay guys this one is probably one of my favorites that i got it is so incredibly simple but i think the kind of sporty look is so nice and it feels so good like this one too no worries i could play beach volleyball in this i could be jumping around doing anything that i want so the top here is a string but it has an adjustable clasp so you can make it tighter or looser which is also really nice because if you're in between sizes you can probably size down and have the option or if you feel like maybe you should size up once again you have the option so another one that's pretty safe if you're unsure about your size for this one let me check what size i got so this one i did get a medium because the adjustable straps were there and i knew that i would be comfortable i thought that maybe i would have a little bit of extra coverage be able to put it a little bit higher up if i got a medium so that's what i went with the top very very simple just the more straight across which once again makes you feel really comfortable and like i said it's a medium so i have some extra room so if ever you're a little bit bigger in the chest area this is pretty safe and very, very simple in the back as well. But like I said, really one of my favorites and I love this color, like a deep turquoise teal color, I think is really, really nice. Okay friends, up next we have this little yellow suit and honestly, I'm so excited about the shade of yellow that this came out. I didn't want it to be too bright yellow. I didn't want it to be like too dark mustard yellow and I feel like this is the perfect in between. I think it is, so nice, so this one at the bottom is another one of those that ties, so it gives you a good amount of flexibility for sizing. It is also pretty cheeky. Once again, you don't need to see it, you get the point. And the top has another one of those Vs here. My only thing with this top is you can see the pads a little bit, they even come out at the top here, but I think if I took the pads out, there would be a little bit too much nippage. So I'm gonna keep them in. Obviously, I haven't tried any of these in the water yet, so that is yet to be determined but I still am happy with how they turned out considering how affordable they are on Zaffle. And the back of this bathing suit is just a very simple straight across with uh, the straps that clasp in. So there we have it for this one. I will put the size up on the screen because I forgot to check what size it is. <laughs> okay, it is hard to go wrong with a nice fitting, good old fashioned triangle bikini and this is exactly that. To me, this is pretty much the perfect triangle bikini because this here is pretty adjustable, gives you a good amount of coverage. Once again, I am very small chested and this is a medium, so that's important to consider if you are on the bigger chested side, then maybe size up to make sure you have enough coverage, but adjustable the strap here and adjustable at the top like most triangle bikinis, so it gives you a good amount of wiggle room. Bottom is simple, the tie again, pretty cheeky, but not quite quite as 
as cheeky as some other ones. There's still a little bit of, of material there. Um, and this is that waffle type of material that has been pretty popular lately and it actually doesn't feel very cheap. Like last time, two, three years ago when I ordered from Zaffle and I got one in this type of material, it looked cheap. Like it honestly, I don't even think I have a word, but this one actually feels pretty good. It's double lined, so you, you know, you feel pretty secure. This one doesn't even have a cup pad and there's absolutely no nippage, nothing like that. So really, really happy with this one. So we're almost done, only one more. And lastly, we have this green one. So I thought this color of this one was really, really nice. This one is actually a pretty soft material. Like I was surprised at how soft it feels. So this one has this little knot detail here. So you can see the cups a little bit once again, which is kind of just part of it when you order from Zaffle. The quality is not necessarily the highest. So you can often see the pads a little bit, but it doesn't bother me too, too much. And then it also has the same knot on either side. I thought from looking at it that these knots were going to be like the ones that you can kind of move and help adjust, same here, but they don't, they don't move at all. It's just there for design, which is completely fine. This one too, a little bit more on the higher, uh, higher leg, um, so you can bring it up a little bit over your hips, which I think is always more flattering than having it down, but you have the option. This one is also medium and it's the first one that feels a little bit big, a little bit loose. So just keep that in mind. The top also a little bit loose, but to be expected, especially for me, because I'm usually more of a small in tops. And then the back of this, once again, very, very simple. What I will say with most of the bathing suits that I got from Zaffle for the tops, all of the ones that had the clasp at the back, already just from like moving them around, the clasps do come off pretty easily, which is something that worries me a little bit. You know, I don't really want to be swimming around and have one of them pop open. So once again, something to keep in mind, but I think, I mean, anytime you're buying a bathing suit for like $10, like top and bottom for $10, I think your expectations can't be too high either. So all in all, considering all of that, I would say that I'm really happy with my haul. I got seven bathing suits and honestly, I love all seven. I'm going to be wearing all seven. Hopefully they hold up decently well, but once again, for $10 a bathing suit, you know, your expectations need to be set <laughs> at the right level. So with that in mind, I'm really, really happy. Highly recommend. Like I said, their quality has gone up over the years. So hopefully it continues to do so. But that is it, guys. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you found this helpful. If you do have a trip coming up, if you're already thinking about bathing suits ahead of time for summertime, or if you're really lucky and you live somewhere that's always warm and you can always swim, well, good for you. But like I said, they will all be linked below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. Bye.